Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. Today we are building a base game only build. So this here is our base game build for the week. Uh, if you don't know, I post three times a week. I post on Wednesdays, Thursdays and Fridays at 6 p.m. And at least once a week, I like to include a base game only build just so that everyone can get something um so this is it uh this here is a more rural <laughs> that is such a difficult word for me to say i don't know why uh, this is a rural type of house uh as you might notice we are not building it in a base game world i love building in this world this is granite falls and it comes with outdoor retreat uh, which is a game pack I love this world. If you like woodsy builds, uh, this world is perfect. And Outdoor Retreat, I think it is a very underrated pack because this world alone is amazing. Um, we have a lot of beautiful worlds, but some of them have terrible, terrible lighting. For example, Copperdale. Uh, the world is beautiful, but it is so dark there. The same with the werewolf world, beautiful world, absolutely dark. Uh, so if you like building, especially if you are sharing it somewhere, uh, you will have to do a lot, a lot of like photo editing just to take a proper like thumbnail for YouTube, uh, just because it is so dark and gloomy all the time. Anyways rambling over i love this world okay <laughs> so the house um since it is base game only we do struggle in some areas one of them is obviously furnishing um although i love most things that come with base game for example windows and doors i have no issues with those more or less but furnishings i really do because we have either two I would I should say three options in base game furniture. You have very modern, you have Hispanic looking furniture, and you have very traditional. Now the very traditional sofas would not suit this house. They're very big, very expensive looking, and very fancy looking. No. And the Hispanic one, no, because I'm not building a house in that style so i had to resort to go the more modern way which is what happens in loads of my homes so i end up using the same type of furnishings everywhere um but that is just the limitations of the game hopefully we will we'll get at least a few beds or couches base game um we desperately need those uh at least give us different colors like this sofa here is not too bad it is right at the middle between modern and traditional it is just a basic looking couch it only has three colors though it has orange green and this cream color um so i would like more colors of that couch please <laughs> now the beauty of this house is this outdoor area out here um now the house is quite small but i did think that it suited a swimming pool just because i need sims to have things to do on the slot so i created a little swimming pool which eventually we will of course color it green because that is what i do in every build i do oh there's my alarm one sec uh, <laughs> i do enjoy this blue pristine looking water but you know at a different place a different world a different type of build in builds like this i like to make it look as natural as possible so i tend to color it green um also, by the way, in the screenshots, if you stick until then, you will notice that there is no terrain paint whatsoever on this lot. That is a glitch. So on the gallery, there is terrain paint on there. It's just, it disappeared by the time my sim came to this lot. Uh, it is gone, but it is there, I promise. So on the outside area, we, like I mentioned, we do have a small little swimming pool we have a pergola i built and there's a few little lounge chairs underneath and then of course like every other build i make there is a dining table and a grill then we also have 
a sitting area outside it is sheltered underneath the house uh, so you know if you like planting and stuff it will be perfect to put there because some plants they need shelter during some different months so that will be perfect i don't know if i mentioned this before because this is not the first time that i've been i've done this uh, voiceover just because it is raining so badly outside and storming and it's being so loud but this house has two bedrooms two and a half bathrooms so it has a half bathroom downstairs and then there's two bedrooms upstairs there's the master suite which is what you're watching right now then there is a child's bedroom and they both have their own bathroom uh, so no one has to share then on the downstairs area we have a sunken in kitchen Although that is something that I like to do quite a lot just because it maximizes the height of the walls itself. I had to do that because the way the house is built and the way the roofs are placed, um, the eaves, they hang low. So the windows needed to be at a certain height. So in the kitchen, if I didn't sink it in, then that would mean that the cupboards would pretty much cover up like half of the windows. And, you know, we need natural light in our homes. So we are not going to do that. So I sunk the kitchen in twice. So there's just two little steps into the kitchen. The kitchen is quite small, but there's enough space for you to do what you want. And that is basically it. And there's also a very low bay window in the sitting room as well. If you do not like that, then you can, of course, pull up the eaves of the house uh, and just adjust the windows to the height you want. Um, I did not want to do that just because it made the walls look extremely tall and uh, just the roof, it, it does not look very good in my opinion. And I always give priority of how the house looks on the outside not the inside of the house so sometimes we just have to work with what we want um, i was able to sneak in two little beds in this room uh, here um, as you can see and a wardrobe and some toys and some things anyways here in the screenshots as you can see it is very gloomy outside. I did not want to have to use the weather machine again just to change the weather to take screenshots because I am out of time and I don't have the patience. Anyways, if you want to download this or any other of my builds, then you can of course find me on the gallery. The search for hashtag SimsDesigns or hashtag SimsDesignsYT. Bye! If it's controlling you, I know the time can heal it all I just gotta get through, I just gotta get through I just gotta get through, cause I feel like taking